you in MS Word how to create a note sheet. So a note sheet is something in which there is a in the first page there is some headings and this heading will be repeated in the other pages. Apart from that there will be a border on the left side of your um, I mean left side of your word document. So how can we do that? So let's begin with the step one. We need to insert a heading. So we'll be going to the insert and then we'll be kicking this. Uh, so I'm using Word 2007. So this in Word 2007, there is an uh, option of header. And from there, before inserting any header, we'll be clicking on this edit header. And before writing anything, we'll be selecting this checkbox in the design tab. I mean from the design tab we will be checking this option define first page and then we will be writing some header say so suppose my header is SS Infotech that's the name of my company where I am currently working in so let me write SS Infotech file let me select this portion of text and align it in the middle so control J is for justify, E is to J is to justify, E is to center and L is for left align and R is for right align. So, so for center align, we will be writing control E. Fine. Now, my purpose is to bring a margin on the left side of the screen. How can I bring a margin? So I'll be inserting a table, a table with only one row. Next I'll be going to the design tab and then from there border. I'll be selecting the border. Uh, I'll be selecting. Okay, so borders, bottom, top, rep, right, fine. Border and shading, the last option. From there, I'll be applying border only to the left. So not half point maybe two and one or four point okay so let me check check I mean click on this in the border section whatever it was showing I am click I clicked on the upper portion upper portion and the left portion uh, right portion and the downward portion to delete those borders and then I will be pressing ok so a border has been inserted now I can adjust the margin according to my need so how can I set the margin? I will be going to the page layout, then margin, then custom margin. So suppose my organization is saying that the left will be not 1, maybe uh, 2. So I will be writing 2. It's 2 inches and I will be pressing OK. So 2 inches means this will be in this position. So let me again go to custom margin and from there change from left of 2 to maybe 1 then press ok now whenever I am writing some textual document in it this is a text maybe this is a text enter something let me select all of this text control C to copy the text and press control V several times control V V V so this is how you will be creating a note sheet. So you can again select this particular option, go to table properties and you can change the margins. So there is row, there is column, there is cell and table properties. So border and shading, I will be clicking this option and from there you can apply border to the top, to the left and downward portion press ok then press ok so basically so see in this SS Infotech uh, this is the heading and in the next page there is no heading such as SS Infotech so this is how we can create a note sheet so before ending the video I will be showing you one last time to create a note sheet all you need to do is that so I have changed my normal dot m template and whenever I am opening up a new word document, this particular thing which is being shown in the screen with warm liquor shomalaka, this will be populated. 
because the normal dot template is the template which gets loaded whenever you are opening up word so I've changed the template so that is another video uh, another topic in where I will be discussing on how to change the normal dot dot m that is whenever we are opening up a word the template which will be it will be opening on it will be have some I mean it will be having some text and the template to change the template that is another topic so before ending the video what I'll be doing is that uh, I'm pressing ctrl a from my keyboard and clearing out the working area I'll be inserting a header so uh, I won't be selecting any option I'll be clicking on edit header and before writing anything I'll be selecting this define first page header and you can insert a picture for the header also so let me uh, let me oh, you can, we can insert a picture from here but I'll be inserting a blank text so I'll be going to the design and before writing any anything I'll be selecting this particular option define first page and after that I'll be uh, writing the text the text will be maybe dummy text dummy text Ctrl A to select all of the text and then press Ctrl E from the keyboard to uh, make it center aligned and for the note sheet to for uh, border to apply the border to the left side of the screen I will be inserting a one table and let me select the table by clicking on the upper left corner in the plus section and I will be table properties and from there I will be going to border and shading and you can change that uh, the border will be page border it will be only in the left section um, let me change the width of it maybe three point and border is on the left and if we want to I mean you can just 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 click on uh, the upper portion or the left portion or the right portion to remove the borders and press ok then again press ok and there is a border so no I didn't insert a table let me press ctrl z from my keyboard let me insert a table so here is a table and I will want to make some changes to the table so I will go into the layout tab not layout design and from there borders from the design tab I will go into the borders and then border and shading from that option I will be unchecking this upper right and the lower portion and I will be changing the width say maybe 3 point I can change the color as well maybe it will be blue one and press ok that's it so now whenever I am writing something this border will be applied so what I will be doing is that I will be equal to equal to rand rand function to generate random text and press enter and whenever this document is in the next page so what happens if this document I mean skips into the next page so control enter is for control enter is for no this doesn't work well control z maybe so what I'll be doing is that pressing enter okay so it didn't work some the way I I mean let me see what happens in the next page press enter 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 and yeah so that's what I have achieved there is a margin in the left portion and you can adjust the margin by just see the cursor uh, just bring your cursor over this margin until and unless the cursor changes to double arrow and I'll be clicking on it and you can adjust the margin uh, I mean so this is how you can create a note sheet and if you wish to I mean uh, apply border to the uh, downward section uh, I mean uh, uh, apply border to right or maybe upper or maybe lower you will be clicking on this section and then go to table properties and from there you will be going to border and shading and from there border and shading you can go to apply page border to say suppose in the uh, lower section just click on it and you can give it a color maybe red uh, yeah red and maybe it will be 4 point and press ok let me click here and press ok fine and okay so see in each page there is a border in the in, there is a lower border 
so this is how you can apply a border to your textual document and that's all about note sheet so note sheet are something which are being used by government uh, i mean government employees uh, every now and then practice all by yourself to achieve this particular feature i mean to how to make note sheet that's all for this video tutorial hope you have liked it uh, do throw a like subscribe to my channel and do uh, come i mean give some comment i mean write something in the comment section that what videos i will be working i mean some suggestions that i'll be making some videos in later point of time so i mean this uh, likes subscriptions and throwing comment what it basically does is that it motivates me to make more videos more of like, more videos something like this uh, to share it with you guys and i'm not monetizing my channel so this is a free video content so you can motivate me by simply clicking on the like button subscribe button and giving in some comment thank you guys this was all for this video tutorial short video tutorial around notesheet in ms quad and happy coding